In this video you'll learn who Spallet really is, his story, and why he is so dangerous. It's the first time I use my voice in a YouTube video. Be careful. After watching this video, your life will be in danger. The videos of Spallet. There is really a huge amount of data in Spallet videos. Description of the armies. Names of the protagonists. Numbers, places, battles, and other things. Amazing. But Spallet is too dumb to know all this data. So, where does he collect all this information? Really, it looks like he was there. Was there? Was Spallet there? Yes, that's the truth. Spallet was there, in those parallel realities. Because Spallet knows how to enter parallel dimensions. He is a traveler. I know, you are shocked. But that explains everything. By traveling through the parallel dimensions, he can collect all data he wants without the need to use his low-level brain. He can select a dimension in which Hitler won World War II, watch what happens, come back here, and make the video. But Spallet not only knows how to cross parallel dimensions, he comes from a parallel universe. This explains why Spallet cannot decently speak any human language. Because his native language is not from this world. But why has he never told us anything about the parallel universe he was born into? It would certainly be a good video. I know the answer. Because he is ashamed. Because in the parallel universe in which he was born, he was a sexual slave. In his parallel universe, it is the year 4150. It is a technologically very advanced world. You cannot even imagine it. The world is almost a paradise. No wars, no illness or disability, no pollution, no need to work every day. Technology has solved every problem. There are no seasons, just a 12 month long spring. Babies are kept in artificial cribs for nine months. No more pregnancy. There's not real mother or father. At the birth, they have a development comparable to five years. There is only one city, Tremantala, which covers the entire planet. The world is ruled by women. About 2000 years ago, humanity began to chemically produce sperm using the marrow of women. Men became more and more useless. No hard work, no need for soldiers or policemen. The evolution of males stopped and now they are less intelligent and less strong than a woman. Women are up to 2,5 meters tall. Men are rarely taller than 1,70. Since men are now almost useless, they are kept in domination. When they leave the maternity facilities, the children are assigned to a mother who raises and educates them. The girls are raised not too differently from how they are raised today. Male, less intelligent, are treated differently. Punishments are allowed and common. They have different school. Once they reach the adolescence, they are assigned to another woman. When Spallet reached adolescence, Lou and Spallet's mother gave him to Florian, one of her friends. So, after the handover ceremony, Spallet moved into the house of Florian. He was happy to move to the other home. His mother was quite strict. Spallet started his new life with Florian and her two daughters. But another woman fell in love with him. Katrine, an old scientist. Katrine offered Florian a gigantic sum of money, but Florian refused to give Spallet to her. After the refuse, Katrine decided to run away with Spallet, who agreed to run away with her. But it would have been impossible to hide in that hyper-technological world. So, they fled to the only place where they could remain free. Another parallel universe. Katrine was an inventor and an engineer. She was in charge of one of the machines capable of transporting a person across parallel universes. The two lovers escaped to another parallel universe, where they hoped to be able to stay together. But once they got to another dimension, Spallet stole the trans-universe machine and ran away from her. And now, he is here. Do I have evidence of all this? Yes. Spallet told his story in his first video. It was uploaded on YouPorn, but it was banned after a few hours, because it was too perverted even for YouPorn. But I have a copy of it. Russia is interested in this machine to cross parallel dimensions and protect Spallet. 
Do you understand the immense power of such a weapon? With Spalit's machine, called Superstella, the Russians could find a way to invade us, scouring a parallel universe in which Russia successfully invaded the USA, and copying the strategy from them. But there is another problem, much, much worse. Florian is looking for him. She wants him back. She will never resign herself. Spalit also wants to go back to her. And when she finds out where Spalit is, she will destroy our world. This is why Spalit is a problem. For all of us. I know what you are wondering. How could I be sure that you porn's tale isn't a pure invention of that idiot? Simple. When Spalit and Katrine fled from Trementala, they weren't alone. There was someone else. Katrine had another man before Spalit. Myself. And I was forced to follow them when they ran away. And now I'm here. I'm the only one who can stop Spalit. I'm the only hope of this world.